In this video, I embrace the big Dicker energy with the 105mm cannon on the Dicker Max and in this intro, I get the most funny and disrespectful kill I've ever had. Is this dude... Is he gonna try and cross this bridge? Can I shoot the bridge out? upside down <laughs> I can't see them for my tears okay the bot um, dropped the bomb on him please tell me it doesn't hit the bridge Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Today have I got an action-packed video for you using the Dicker Max. Now the past couple of days we've been covering like horrible vehicles that aren't really fun to play so I thought we'd do stuff that's the complete opposite. This is a 105mm cannon strapped to this weird chassis that is a very big gun for 4.3. We almost have 190mm of penetration point blank. This thing has Oh, look at that TNT equivalent. Basically 360 grams of TNT. This is, is a big dick. Dude, this tank has the most fitting name for any tank in the game. Now, I think Mr. Self-Propelled Gun himself here was 5.0 when I first started playing. He might have been 4.7, I'm not sure. But he's been going down in BR more and more so over the years. Now he's at 4.3. This means that we'll fight things at 3.3 that will run circles around us, but so long as we get a hit on anything, it's gonna die. Like, really, what the hell can survive this thing? Now, of course, at 4.3, it's kind of bristling with Russian and US cannon casts. Honestly, anything with an MG strapped to this airplane is a really big threat to you. People will bomb you, strafe you, they'll do everything to get you out of the game. You're basically a big free loot pinata for silver lines and research points, but if you get the right spot, you can be pretty hard to find. Funny enough. We have a grand total of five crew members inside that makes us kind of survivable and really our armour isn't that bad. It can stop most machine gun stuff from the front. It's just at the sides where it really suffers to 50 kills. It's... you'll be surprised just how many shots you'll survive with this thing. Of course, long range is the name of the game in this thing and it can do that very well. It has a very high zoom optic, almost like Leo 1 levels for its battle rating. It's very, very good. Mobility sucks, but it doesn't matter. You can basically sit in your spawn behind a defilade. Negative 15 degrees of vertical guidance. That's a lot of depression. Now, I wasn't really expecting to do very well in this thing, so I decided to bring out, of course, the 109 F4. It's one of my favourite fighters in the game. And the ground pounder extraordinaire, the German A-10 of World War II. This is the HE-219. Two 30mm cannons, almost 90mm pen. Uh, we're gonna do some work in this thing. Anyway, enough talk. Let's get to dicking some maxes. Okay, I've decided to spawn on this side. I'm gonna try and get up there, behind me. I wanna see what it's like to be a German main. God, I really like that NAS horn, but this is depression, it's pretty awful. And the tank leaning back, like this one too. This one leans back, so you don't get the full 15 degrees. You still get a lot though. About 12 or so. So, more than your average. Big, long, long anti tank boy. Got that enemy team's on A already. I bet we're against Italy, right? No. Oh, France, EBR. That's exactly what that is. Fill up here. I, I mean, as expected. As expected. You got a H1. I'm hoping we'll get a Panther D in our team. That would be pretty game changing. Now, I might not get up here without getting dinged from somebody. We'll see what happens. It's already telling me to return to battlefield. I wonder where that NAS horn is going. A lot of these players... I don't... I don't like fighting in the middle of the map. So a lot of these players know much better spots than I do. I like to kind of watch where people go and stuff, but... When they do stuff like this, I don't really pay attention. <laughs> so this is a, a really experimental phase I'm going through right now. Oh, there goes the the Curiosity Rovers as well. We got a, a Jumbo has pushed their spawn here as well. That's exciting. What the hell is this on, Mark? 
Binoculars. Right, one thing is unfortunate we're going to experience is we've got nowhere really to back up, I don't think. God, I stood pushed, pushed up there very far. Good on you, dude. You love to see it. Right, 50 cows coming from the A cap. Teammates are already firing at things over on B. Two KB1Cs here. God, I can see their spawn from here. I'm actually going to get a quick range find from there. 800 ish. There's the there's the curiosity rover getting beat up now. Not much going on over this side, but there's two jumbos in our spawn on the other side. Kinda of glad I didn't spawn over there. God, our team is wiping them out. The Panther D. Who would have thunk it? Aha. A Churchill. Out there. There we go. There we go, dude. That, that's almost a long range yeet. Almost. Friendly. I think our stars. Oh. I think that might be a T3485 up here. I'm way too low. I'm gonna die. Okay, hopefully that other Sherman didn't notice me. I don't think he did. Although we'll see if he backs up in a second. He's looking for me for sure. And there's another one back there too. This shouldn't be working but it kind of is right now. Oh, we've got another Russian MG that side. And an anti-air which is honestly scarier than anything else. Oh, hello big man. Uh oh. The close air support is up. I know I'm not in the battlefield. I'm well aware of that. I don't know how far up these guys are going to push. And I might get counter sniped from their spawn. It's kind of cool watch, overwatching the entire map from here. I wish I could get it. I'll look at whatever's fired in 50 cals there. We are kind of... Oh. That's a SU-85, I think. Aha. Uh -huh. A Sherman. Right, okay. Where's that SU gone? There he is. Right here. I don't think I have a squad mate to... See... Oh, he's been hit. There we go. Yo, we're doing okay. We're doing okay. We can do, work a little bit of magic with a big old gun. This is the end of me, probably. Oh, we are. We still haven't been discovered yet. I could just jam my S key in and remove myself from the situation if we need to. What are you? God, my gun is bouncing everywhere. Chaffy. This Panzer IV is getting that. Hard time. This is not good. I just missed them too. Oh my goodness, this is terrifying. Okay, we've fallen and I don't think we can get back up. We've been killed by proxy. Come on. Come on, Dicker. Oh, we've got quite a bit to go to get back into the map, I think. And I have to go the flattest way. I'm gonna die. Oh, but we made it, we made it! 
We're okay. We're okay. Oh god. That was so close. Right. Yo, that, that was a very low tier bomber too. That was a very low tier bomber. SV-57. I delete Tom. Delete Tom's the scariest one. And now we back up. <laughs> the IS-2 is looking at us now. <laughs> ah, I see you there, buddy. Yo, I, I'm a little bit mental, but I'm not that mental. And the AS-357 staring at me. Hold on. I can't see over my hairy bush. Still can. The IS is bagged up. Yeah, we are. Oh. There's not much we can do right now. Well, these two guys are still. Oh, no, no. This is not good. <laughs> okay, it wasn't, for it wasn't meant for me. I think the ASU, ASU 57 is here. IS 1's dead. ASU 57 is not looking at me anymore. Go on, big man. Come on. Over the hell and far away. Odd Buzz has come to play. Oh, this is not. This is not a nice thing to do. I should have loaded AG. I think he could move if he wanted. Our Churchill is here as well. I'm almost running out of ammo. That was that was a bully. That was a bully right there. We got a 109 F up. Where the hell is this Churchill at? On the cap? I did see another tank fishing this open field. Oh there's my breach gone. Oh, it's a delete Tom. It's going to take a wee while for me to repair this. We got eight kills doing this. It's pretty silly. And the Jumbo's still camping our spawn on the other side. That delete Tom's still alive. Even though... We've got a Jagdpanzer 4 on the cap. They might be fighting him right now. I need to get rid of this bush on the... Roof. An EBR. Oh, he's close to us. What is this guy? Got him. Oh, no. Oh, no. No. <laughs> no, dude. Oh, I'm getting bullied by two anti airs. <laughs> Yeah, we'll get, uh, GG, did GG. That was that was a lot of fun. That was a lot of fun. Yeah, considering that, I don't think I really helped my team. Look how many there are. There's three there. Um, there's an enemy playing up. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna play the risky thing. Let's take out the, the 112, 119. Sorry, 219. Oh my goodness, we spawned immediately over the battlefield. Right, here's. There's a bunch of anti-air down here still. Attention to the map. Right, anti is gone, but there's another... There's another uh, M19 or something in the spawn over that side. Oh, he's on fire. He's on fire. Where's this dude in our spawn? He probably needs to be killed, right? Oh my goodness. He's dead. Teammate made sure of that. With a lot of bombs. Oh, I'm being killed by a plane, I think. Oh, he took a lot of damage there with whatever was shooting me. It was a firefly, but our teammate took care of it. With his burble. I really... I think I just need to focus on ground units for my team's sake. Right now. It's not going to matter. The game is over, but... It was enjoyable. Very enjoyable, actually. Mm, we're... They're gonna get <laughs> these trees. That's an odd boss landing right there. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> yeah, that was actually exciting. I don't know if our team is gonna make this bag, but uh, yeah, th this enemy team absolutely obliterated us. Absolutely obliterated us. That's unfortunate. <laughs> that is unfortunate. God, dude, what a game. Oh, we got Finland. We can probably get our gun to work here really well, actually. Let's go. Let's just go right to the middle and watch B. We might get artillery door. We don't have any Italians to fight. That's good news. They're very slow though. Actually, not going down this hill or not. 
the the rescue part is cutting across here we kind of want to be on well uh ping that hill my teammate's gone the other way my squad mate i mean we sometimes see enemies through this little canyon but uh, i want to just get across here as fast as i can though where like shaman 75 the six pounder the russian 76 make mince me out of us frontally but maybe if we're angled we might survive it's all about overpenning this thing i think more than anything else no bully me i think we might be in the clear here this little group of trees might keep us safe oh a firefly just killed a teammate with the arty it was a puma i don't really care about that then I, I hate Pumas. But I don't hate people. But I hate Pumas. I don't hate people that play Pumas. I just don't like the Puma. It's too it's too good. That and the I love the Chaffee. I love I love playing the Puma, okay? Don't listen to what I'm saying here. As in you know that I hate people who play that specific tank because it's not true. I play them too, and it's because they're so good that I hate them. Same as the Chaffee. I like the Chaffee when I'm using it. Yeah, noise mate, it's 3-3. Three, three. There's a lot of things on B. Damn. I can hear like two engines at least, maybe even three. The sound grouping is like mad. Okay, somebody's shooting him right now. Is this guy stuck? I mean, he kinda is. It's a firefly, look. I'm bumped. I got his driver. Wow. The good old, uh, what do you call it? Volumetric, say it with me. Volumetric. Can I shoot through the hell though? Just kind of watching me through it. Let's track. He fired too though. I'm hoping a teammate will kind of distract them for a wee while. Yeah, or, or kill him. Equally as good. Right, our binos are... Am I going to die to a plane already? No, it's friendly. Oh, it's a 410B? Dude. He got there fast. That must have been the Puma. What's my teammate shooting now over here? We, are, we got stuck for backup. Here I am telling you that nothing can survive this gun and then we have fireflies above from plate where this track armor is in it. At like 400 millimeters of overlap. Does NATO guy actually need help over here? Wait. What is that? A rock. It looked like a deadly rock. What is happening in the sky? No, I did see a guy over here. It's a T-34. Oh, he's dead. Oh, I-410. And KV-85 is dead there too. I almost got my teammate killed. I would hope this wreckage would disappear. I don't think it's going to. Are most of the enemies on A side? No, I refuse to believe that's the case. Uh, Panzer 4J is engaging somebody down this lane. Wish our binos were higher up. He was just absolutely destroying them. Oh, a Churchill is coming. But uh, from where? Give you one seizure, you'd already see him. I would imagine. We should make mince me uh, even an angled Churchill. Oh, there's a big boy over here too that I've just missed. This guy, this Churchill, pushing them. If you reverse back a wee bit more, I can maybe help you. Oh, this is awkward. Oh, there's a T-34 here. Oh, yeah, 57 as well. Quick reload. And bonk. There we go. There we go, an actual kill. I don't see anything else going on here. Our M6 and our Panzer 4F2 are engaging that lane. There's another guy sneaking over here. 
Okay, we're, we're moving. We're changing positions. I haven't seen a dead Churchill 3 in the kill feed yet, but that doesn't mean it hasn't happened. Oh. This isn't good. Oh my god, that plane was really close. I'm getting tickled by machine gun fire. Oh, my friendly. Right, Achilles and a saint is dead. Oh boy. This UA5 is scary. Are you coming up here, dude? Let's go. Oh, it's Metropolis. Right, um. Wait, we can just really not do anything here, just wait until we see things. That mosquito is dead, thankfully. We got an IL2 up. Our team is doing fantastic right now. <laughs> what caps up? Yo, leave some for me. <laughs> Did really well. Uh, there's not very many enemies left, actually. <laughs> Look at that, yes. All right, here we go. Oh! <laughs> we're probably sort of too busy hanging out. Vibing that we noticed that Churchill was there. I think he's fighting a Cromwell as well, this KV-1. Oh, Lubu's here too! God, all the people are here. Yo, Lubu is a really cool streamer, by the way. It's Lubu, his name is on... It's the same name that's on his... On the scoreboard here. This guy, he's an Astro. Super nice dude, and he makes custom skins. Some of them are actually in the marketplace too. Gaijin thought they were so cool that they're gonna add them into the game. So go check him out. Especially on the War Thunder Live. Uh, oh, there's a guy up here. I just saw cannon fire. God, uh, this is crazy that a lot of people in here are people who are like Discord community and Twitch community and do content creation. This is awesome to see. Amazing. Ah, uh, KB, KB1C killed that. 122. Oh, this team just ruined these guys. Oh, KB1C just got shot. There's two things here. Right, that T-34 is dead? Yeah. God, look at this. Our squad is just like... This is tight knit, dude. It, these games are like, cool. But at the same time, not much to shoot at. Really? You've seen somebody here. The dicker is coming. I think I'm going to want to include this game just because it was a nice, friendly, happy environment. Hi! He bounced! I told you the armor works! I told you! I don't know what it is with this thing. There's just weird overlaps and stuff. Where did he shoot me, actually? He didn't hit nothing important! <laughs> An ace! Yeah, I'm pretty pleased with that. This is definitely going on YouTube, though. GG! I really love those like wholesome games where you meet somebody you know but when there's like four or five people that come from discord or the other streamers or stuff like that it's just really nice also shout out to the reaper i think that i missed in the chat box i'm sorry dude hello anyway the decker max is a whole lot of fun for 4.3 as well there's a good bunch of vehicles to bring out the hsr panzer 4h things like that the this guy. We didn't go on a rampage on it. Well, I did in an Alaska match, but I didn't include it because it was more the plane than the Dicker Max. But 4.3 Germany is a really outstanding BR to play. And you've got the Wind, And uh, 4. And the G2 if you want. Anyway, if you enjoyed that video, please leave me a wee like. It would massively help out the channel. And subscribe for War Thunder content nearly daily. I'm going to say nearly daily now rather than every single day, because I think that makes more sense, especially since... 
I might be moving house and get better internet and be able to stream. Shh, don't tell anybody. Also, a huge thanks to all the patrons over on Patreon. You guys are bloody awesome. That's all the tier three people as well that get a shout out. That's Matthew S, Jesse Mills, Bill L, Brahma Nation, Sexy, Ethan, Excavation Nation, Gateway, Houndy, Ian, Justin Darlin, Kim the Salt Lord, Ralph, Rage, Stoyan, The Fire Piper, Trash Panda, Useless Tortilla, Vanian, Warpig, Zemma, Ollie Fox, Yorkbo, Shaf, Jesse Bisma, Fork, J Tormey, and Mr. Buzzwell. You guys are amazing. And to everyone still here, thank you very much for watching. Much love and bye bye.